How to get started with Flint by creating a new wallet. Let's begin. First, you select your language of preference. You agree to terms and conditions, then click continue. You select your privacy policy preference. In this screen, you are asked what type of network you'd like to connect your wallet to. Should you select the mainnet option, you'll be working with real world cryptocurrencies like ADA, and this would involve some real world costs. Should you select the testnet option, you will be working with test tokens with no value. For beginners, we highly encourage that you go with the testnet option first. You're presented with some information to better explain how the testnet works, and you click confirm once you've understood. You select create a new wallet. On this screen, you're presented with your recovery phrase, which you must not give to anyone and must ensure it's safely guarded. From there, you can save it. Once you've successfully entered your recovery phrase, you'll be asked to set a password to keep your wallet safe. Your password must be at least 10 characters long. You click create my wallet once you've had that set. Next, you're asked to set up an optional passcode which you can use to further secure your wallet. Let's proceed with next. And after this step, you would have successfully created your wallet for Flint.